Yeah, James, you have the ice cream. It looks absolutely delicious. You have the ice cream. We have the main course. We're here at Murphy's Pub in DeWitt. We've got some cheese curds. We've got some wings. Now, that's just the start. We're going to be eating for the next two hours, but we have a lot of sports to talk about because here in DeWitt, it's Saber country. A lot of big sports here. Of course, the high school sports really integral to what they do here in the community. Started back in 1932. Their football team that year won every single game and it's an undocumented record. They didn't give up a single point. They believe that's the only team to ever do that in state history. Yeah, Kirk Kreider gave us that information. I'd love to see those documents that he has right. somewhere to see if it's right. So, yeah, they've been pretty successful. And in fact, they've won 15 state titles in all. And they were really dominant back in the 50s in track. They actually won three state titles in a matter of six years. Then they won another one back in 2009. That was boys track. So track pretty good up here in Sabre country. Yeah, the recent success came in boys golf. They won back to back state titles in 2017 and 2018. Some other recent success success. We'll show you some video of the boys basketball team in 2022. They finished state runner up in Des Moines. Great season led by all stater Sean Gilbert. Of course, they beat Assumption in the state semifinals. They tell you around here you have to mention that they beat Assumption That's in right. the state semifinals. They're pretty proud about that as well. And of course, they've had a lot of success in other sports as well. Kyle. Yeah, one of those sports will be baseball. They've made it as a state runner up in baseball just recently, but also Central, De Central DeWitt has produced some professional athletes including a pair in recent years. 2016 grad TJ Sykema was drafted in 2018 by the New York Yankees. He's now currently a left-hand pitcher in the Royals organization in Double A. We were hoping he'd come here to play with the Bandits, but he didn't. He's at Northwest Arkansas playing with the Naturals. And of course, you can't talk about Central DeWitt sports without the last name Kreider. Kurt Kreider was a longtime football coach, athletic director, making a huge impact on Spartan Nation, or Sabre Nation, I should say. His son, Casey Kreider, played football at Iowa. He's preparing for his 10th season in the NFL. Kreider currently a long snapper with the Giants. He went to the Pro Bowl back in 2018. So a bunch of great sports success here in DeWitt. Coming up at six o'clock, we'll talk to an athlete that did the success here at, at, the, at, at Central DeWitt and then also did some good things in college and had her kids come through here as well. So a lot to get to. Corey, I have this cheese curd I've been wanting to eat the entire time. So I'm gonna have you that. throw it back to Josh and I'm gonna get eaten. All right, you eat and Josh, let's go back to you in the studio for oh. see what's coming up next here on News 8 at 5.